Hi, this is Shadi. On April 29th, 1965, Risei Kano, son of Jigoro Kano, received a letter from Gunji Koizumi. It said, Respectful announcement. Living the remainder of my old life, I am too bored to wait for the law of heaven. I would like to take the liberty of excusing myself one step in advance. I would like to express my deep gratitude to you for the respectful communications and teachings that I received from you. I wish you an achievement of great missions and much happiness of your family. Respectfully announced. On the back of the letter it was written, The path of belief is independent of life and death. After sending the letter, Gunji Koizumi sat in his favorite chair and Gunji Koizumi was no more. The letter would later appear in the July 1965 issue of Judo, Kodokan's monthly magazine. Many would consider the act of Koizumi cowardly or weak, but I don't necessarily see it that way. Koizumi was 79 years old at the time. He lived a long, successful, and prosperous life. He did not want to end his life in pain, illness, and helplessness. Koizumi Sensei had his reasons that he alone knew. If your life is only beginning, then I ask of you, please, never take a permanent solution to a temporary problem. The world might seem pointless and ending, but it isn't. The mats can help. But make sure you always surround yourself with family, friends, and most importantly, people who are equipped to deal with such tendencies. If I can go back to my teenage self in his hospital bed and tell him the things he would later achieve, he wouldn't believe me. You never know what your own future holds. Don't end it too soon. This was Shadi, and thank you for listening. Going mental, and Greg Fallon's comeback match has gone.